this seminar, the experience with Power Park, it actually brought, I think, the world together. It brought a common thread among man. It made people realize that it is only because of the limitation of minds and exposure that we sometimes create fears within ourselves and keep us from receiving our destiny. I think the speakers transfer a tremendous amount of wealth to everyone. And wealth does not start with financial capital, but it starts in the mind and the ability and the person to believe in their dream and to build upon concept and to expand upon innovation upon innovation. Uh, Andy, those and all the other speakers were tremendous. Um, it feels good that a small archaeological nation like the Bahamas, uh, whereas uh, we have great international speakers, men of renown, and uh, who would have earned their keep. Uh, would come down and uh, mingle with us and through the experience you begin to realize that there is a common trend that despite their ilk and society how high up they may be that they are but common men who had uncommon dreams and uncommon power and as the end result all of us can follow that same trail. Um, I am very very grateful for it. It's a blueprint, it's a motivational tool and I think they would have deposited in the hearts of many of us wealth and wealth is not just a ka-ching but they transfer in our heart the ability to get wealth they empowered they liberated they set free and i can feel the energy in the room and the joy the compassion that persons are showing um, as a result of their sharing here today so hey as we always say God uh, the session was awesome, it was empowering, um, and I'm happy that I am here today uh, receiving all of this good information. So, um, it was great. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm an attorney by profession, um, but I am in real estate. So, uh, Hi, my name is Leanne Wilson and I am a proprietress of Lemon and Christie Soy Factory where we got one farmers to start the finish. And in the South Starters program, I got $5,000 grant in regards to my business and it helped a lot in the beginning. And then throughout the years, um, it was a little bit of a hassle, um, just trying to make it, but it, it, like I said, the South Starters program the $5,000 gram was a great help for me. Um, although I went through some trials and tribulations, I still overcome it. And now what I'm planning to do with my business is to have a sewing school where I teach people how to sew. And what I'm doing now is that I have a show on Zen Nest called Sewing at Home where I teach you how to sew. So this is me now, and hopefully you'll see me in the future being a multi-millionaire in the sewing field. I would like to have the opportunity for my business and my employees and so on to hire more unemployees to expand the Jastic landscape where we can put the service into um, franchise such as hotels, um, different residential, commercial and I just hope it expands. Okay. And, um, Okay. One more thing, one last thing. If you were to say what the one single thing that is the secret to your success, what would that be? Well, the secret to my success is based on my resume, the experience and the workplaces I worked in the last past ten years. From leaving high school, not graduated, um, went straight to nature's way landscaping for about six months. I went to Caribbean landscaping for about two years, learning plants, studying plants, learning how to grow, uh, just learning the nature. Um, work also for Nature's Helper, Atlantis. My biggest break was Atlantis. Um, I'm not there anymore. I left in 09. And I got certified over there with the FNGLA. There's the certificate. Three, what is it? It is a three-month program course, a short course, professional horticulturist, and it's a bunch of guys, even as a community and landscape departments and landscape association, the Bahamas are spread big. 
with this thing. Um, it's going to go for us being certified contractors and not allowing the illegal immigrants go in with cutlass and lawn mowers house to house. So it's going to be professionally done. We'll have to call someone and they have to show a card. Just like in the States, you have to show a card and say, hey, I'm certified. Okay. Thank you very much for your time and they wish you all the best. All right. all right, well, hello everyone. I'm Sherelle Carroll of Sage Eden International Media Group. I'm the CEO and founder. And today I thought the seminar was most enlightening, most inspiring. The concept of franchising isn't new, but it's fairly new to the Bahamas. So it was good to see a network of entrepreneurs coming together to develop new ideas and to find ways to innovate to make our country bigger and brighter. And one thing I did like is that they showed you step by step how you can get into the industry. And millionaires were in this room, real estate developers and owners were in this room. So we had the opportunity to network with some awesome connections. So I will definitely be here next time. Thank you. If I were to single out one thing that's the secret to my success, I would say that it's my faith in the giftings that God has placed in me and my ability to not allow fear to dictate when I make the next move. You're welcome. Thank you. I thought it was spectacular. It couldn't have been any better. Um, I've learned a lot from the seminar and I've gained so much and then it, for me, I think it puts people that, I think it gives people the idea that your dreams, you don't have to hold it in. You don't have to take rejection from one person. You can start by yourself and eventually those same people who rejected you will automatically come to you for your ideas. So don't be afraid to overse it. Just embrace it and move with it and keep your vision strong. I mean, that's what I gained from it. Faith and vision. The summit was amazing. I had the opportunity to meet lots of global wealth leaders and that's the area that I'm passionate about and I'm, I'm interested in learning more and so you know just to rub shoulders with persons who have been around the world and who, are, who know not, not only how to create wealth but who have proven business experience and, and have helped so many others get into business. For me I, I was like a sponge. I sucked up as much information. I was at the first, uh, very front, and I learned a whole lot. My notepad is full of notes, and I just can't wait to go home now. And all of the insights that I've gotten from those notes, put them into practice, because I think one of the speakers says, there's always, action is always in season. So in order to really take what you learned today and help you in your business, you have to take action. So that's what I'm hoping to do. And I can't wait for the other, the next summit or the other fall um, events that will come from this. Passion. Passion. Passion will keep you up at night. Passion will keep you going if you get tired, if you get stressed. Um, when the tough times come, you know that, hey, you know what, this is not something that I'm just doing just to make money. I think Dr. Kimbrough said, what would you do for free? And that's where you know where your passion is. So, you know, no matter what comes at you, you're going to keep going because you're passionate about it and you believe within your heart and soul that you are on this planet for a purpose and to make a difference. And once you know that, whatever comes your way, you're going to keep moving. Thank you very much. Thank you. That uh, Mr. and Dr. Dennis Kimbrough did an excellent job. It's very insightful. Um, I actually purchased his two books and I'm going to use them as my secondary Bible because it does, and what they've been doing today is feeding and helping nurture young entrepreneurs and um, with their ideas and the insight and the comprehensible information that they provided today, I think we will definitely be able to succeed. Um, I think to realize the dream and love what it is that you do. Right. All right. Thank you very much. Okay. Uh, it's a pleasure. The workshop this morning it was very encouraging. Uh, that the panelists, every each panelist had something encouraging, <laughs> something motivational to say to us as young people and entrepreneurs. The, the variety of panelists was nice. It was something that you don't get in every workshop that you go to. It was different and it made you feel like relaxed because everyone treated you like they knew you for a long time, treated you like 
you're the only one in the room. You understand? They address everyone one at a time, and everyone gets a chance to ask their own questions. So it, it was informative and encouraging. The secret to my success. The secret to my my success is not worrying about my situation at whatever point in time I'm in and just going for it with no fear at all. Thank you very much. Um, I don't regret being here at all. I thought it was something that was very timely in light of the current economic um, situation worldwide and more young persons getting into business. So this would be this was an excellent time for us to learn from those who've traveled that road and gone ahead and they're now willing to give back so that we can learn from their experiences. The workshop in its totality was very, 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 very good. It was excellent. Um, the presenters were more than informative. They were open to you. They were willing to be access. There was access, and which is such a key factor in any presentation that we can now come ask questions, interact, and seek to glean from the wealth of knowledge that was in the room. I would definitely be back to another one called at any time. Yes. Yes. To yes. 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 Persistency. Persistency. Change and persistency. Be open to change and be willing to continue as the goals that you've set. Thank you very much. Well, one of the things we have to realize is that unless we're communicating with each other, and those who have experienced entrepreneurship or capitalism, uh, we need to take the time to share our knowledge and information. Uh, too often we get knowledge and we sort of clam up and we don't say anything. That's why I wrote the book, Action Has No Season. Uh, it's the strategies and secrets to gaining wealth and authority. Uh, it can be bought on Amazon on my webpage, which is michaelvroberts.com. Uh, this particular group is inspiring to me because it's folks who are saying, I want to change my life. I'm not just interested in having a job. I want to be a job creator. Uh, and I want to be independent. And, and I want to build wealth. And I want my wealth to be sustainable so I can pass it on to the next generation. Once we continue to, to spread that philosophy, that philosophy, that idea, turn into action, then we become very successful as a, as a community. Uh, and the island nation here could be quite successful if we create this ecosystem where we can have a number of entrepreneurs developing, spreading out, and I'd say about 99% of all new jobs would be created by those entrepreneurs. Okay. You just okay. want us to do one. Just want to end it very, very, very sorry about that. They just okay. want us to. One more question. If you, if one more question. If you were to single out one thing, what would be that? That is the secret to your success. Taking action. Taking uh, action. The one single thing that works best is doing it. Being more existential. In other words, living every moment to its fullest extent and and, and living on your dream and pursuing it. Uh, too often we sit back. We don't let ourselves. Uh, experience what we are capable of doing and uh, sometimes that requires you to get in touch with your instinct for you to understand it sense it feel it and then um, you know take action which is my point. Americans or Afro Caribbean or Bahamians I mean we're at the lower indices of all those indicators uh, last in home ownership last in employment last in business startups so this is a start you know, you can't go back and change the past, but you can have a brand new beginning. How? By changing the mindset, changing the thoughts, and changing, you know, learn how to say, I can. Okay. I'm just thinking about one thing that is the secret to your success. What do you say that is? Uh, believe and achieve. I mean, everything happens to you twice in life. First the inner, then the outer, first the thought, and then the thing. And to the extent that you control what goes on the inside of your life, you'll control what goes on the outside. Okay, uh -huh. thank you very much. Uh -huh. It's God a pleasure. Bless.